Hello YouTube. Um, this is not your last duty again. Just checking in uh, to say that um, finally showing my locks. Long beautiful locks. Uh, another person I admire locks, uh, their locks, on um, YouTube is Sakai. I love Sakai locks. As for myself, I do not do too much with my locks. I don't put too much stuff in my locks. In the summer times, I put some um, some of those uh, gold or silver uh, decoration on them. Just maybe one or two, because I, you know, I go to a lot of function, maybe wedding, little parties or whatever, just for it to look nice, nicer. Of course, my locks are beautiful, and um, I have a couple gold. Uh, kind of auburn color in it. Actually, I did this because my daughter, she's lax, and uh, she was putting some. I put some color in her hair, and I decided to put a couple in my like, just a couple streaks here and there, maybe about uh, six all together, all over. So as you can see, my lax is a uh, good length. Um, when I stand up, it's uh, touching my bum. I'm about my height is uh, five six, so five six and a half somewhere there. Um, so you have a pretty good idea. Right now, I'm sitting down, so I can't um, show you the full length of it. But um, just to show you that, yeah, they're gorgeous, beautiful locks. Um, Maybe I could share some ideas on how to take care of it. I remember when I started out, I started to twist the roots, as a lot of people do. And for my hair, it, the density is so um, coarse that, it's not, not necessarily coarse, but it's so thick that when I do the twist, it would um, unravel. So one day I met a lady at a gym that I worked out at, and um, she had some beautiful locks in. So I asked her, like, uh, how she takes care of it because even though you're a hairdresser, you I mean you experiment here and there and other stuff but um for myself, um I asked her and then she showed me to do the sister lock. So I've been doing that ever since. Um that's what I've done for my hair, I just sister locks it. Um no, I haven't gone to a lock te technician. Um I do my hair myself. Um Next thing is, uh, yeah, it's very heavy, especially when it got wet. Um, but I do do shampoo. I do make my own shampoo with um, the black soap. Um, I do um, the shea butter, um, like Tanya from Tanya Kikeo. She talked about the shea butter and stuff like that. For me, I I use the black soap. I melt the black soap in water and then I shook it. And I use it for, for um, my shampoo. Um, I find it very, very, very beautiful um, on the locks. I find it it suds very fast on the locks compared to the other shampoo. When you use the other shampoo, it tends not to sud as fast. You have to do like a whole lot. And imagine my locks. If I if I use like um, if I use um, the regular shampoo, I have to use a vast amount. To, to, lock, to wash my locks, but if I use the, the black soap and I, I put it in the bottle and shook it and I use it on my hair, so the first lather, the first, first uh, amount, I, um, the, the first uh, I put it on, it's lathered right away and I got a nice, you know, lathering right down to the, to the, 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 the tip of it. So I do that. I do That's one of my regimen that I use to um, take care of my locks. And, uh, Make sure they're okay. My hair love to be touched. It love to be caressed. Uh, I find it um, it 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 it, it works that way for me. Uh, some people they they lock the hair and they say, you know what? It's locked. Leave it alone. Don't bother. It, it's just gonna grow. It's not. You're gonna have to take care of it. You have to pamper it. You have to be patient with it. You have to make sure you maintain it just as much as you would maintain if you were doing like uh, chemicals. When you do a chemicals, you would do, it, you do your, your conditioner and then you do your shampoo and you do all of that. And you have to just take care of your locks just the same way. Because for it to be gorgeous and looking fabulous, 
uh, you, you just have to do all uh, these regimens and make sure you take care of your luck skillfully. And once you do that, then you know you're gonna get admired from here to there. I mean, people being admiring it, so it's a good thing to luck, and um, I've enjoyed it. I remember a funny story when my mom years ago, my mom said to me, uh, I met my mom. Uh, I think we went to a function. And at the time, I had just cut my hair off, and I had these little things. So my mom would look at me, because normally my hair is not, I don't have that long hair, as as um, as much of us would, it's more on a curly, so my mom would say to me, uh, so when I had my perming, and I had the long weave in, and whatever, whatever, she, you know, my mom loved that. So when I cut my hair off, and I decided I want to go natural, I did a china bump like I said in my previous video and my mom saw me at a wedding and I thought I looked fabulous in my my little yo know, <laughs> my little china bump. And my mom said to me, Where did I hear? I said, uh, I'm going it out, uh, and, you know, I'm gonna just wear it natural for a while. And she goes, It looks nice, you know. What if they put on perming I give a perming back because I look better. And of course, um, I just told her whatever she needed to, to hear at the time. Mom, don't worry about it. I'm going to you know, go back to the perm, blah, 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 and you know, mom feel good. You have to make mom feel good. Boy, it's not going to be at the end of it. So that's what I told her. And as you can see, nine years later, ah, here's her luck. <laughs> And now everybody loves my locks, including my family. So, and you know, you find when you start out your locks, a lot of people are going to criticize. You have the ones that accept it, you have the ones who do not accept it, the ones that say, you know what? If you are comfortable with your locks, you find yourself. That's how I see it. You find yourself. You, you're the woman. Like, I could walk into any glamour, glam to glam. Um, affair and with my locks flowing behind me sweetie gorgeous so I don't worry about people and the stigma and all that and, and locks and all that and you take your locks beautify your locks you take care of the fact you take care of any hair on your head honey trust me you be the envy of the town when your locks start to caress you and to hug you when my woman locks really just hugs me and said you know what mm, I love that I love that about my locks my locks when it, it hugs me it's like you're always giving me a hug oh what else is beautiful enjoy and if you need to know more about my locks if you want to know more about my journey in my locks please link me up natural locks beauty I wish I should share some more. Maybe next time we'll talk about another subject. Or, if you want to hear more about my locks journey, how I take care of my locks, what else I do with my locks, let me, up, let me know and I'll start to share. Or maybe the next time we'll talk about maybe what's in the news, maybe family, maybe friends, love affair, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Gorgeous topic. Hmm, interested. Not your last movie. Oh.